Hello, how are we? Well, I am outside. It is freezing cold because it's January the 31st. And I missed doing my little workout on Sunday because we had a big, not big, but a long um, surprise tea party for my daughter's her 18th, which was amazing. It started at two in the afternoon, but it did finish. I went to bed at two in the morning and I still left people there. So I missed my workout on Sunday. So what I wanted to do today, not exactly a full workout, there's still people in the house, so it's quite tricky to do stuff when people are around and they're not used to you filming. But I've come out for a bike ride, see the bike. So I've ridden my bike for about blah, 25, 30 minutes at the moment. It's really windy, although it's, it, I'm at a little bit of a sheltered bit. Um, it is windy, so it's a bit of a tough bike ride. I've got about five layers on. I've got tights on, I've got tracky bottoms, I've got long sleeve top, t-shirt, jumper, my hubby's hoodie, scarf, glove. I've got loads of stuff on. And actually my body is fine. My body's not, my body's not cold, my face is cold. <laughs> helmet hair but I want to show you that there's things you can do anywhere so yes you can go to the gym yes you can go to classes yes you can get stuff on YouTube um, yes there's things that you can do anywhere and I'm here literally in the park so I've biked up to the park and actually I wanted a little bit of headspace I'm listening to a podcast that I haven't had time to to listen to um, at home because there's been so much going on but I needed, because we've had, we've been basically celebrating for a week, so I feel like the size of a mountain. Apart from all these clothes, I needed to do some movement. And so doing a bit of movement, getting a bit of clear headspace, I came out for a bike ride and I thought, I'm going to bring my little tripod with me and I'm going to show you things that you can do. Okay, so there's no, there really isn't any excuse. Okay, there's things you can do at home, at the gym, anywhere. And I'm literally going to show you what you can do with a park bench. <laughs> Nothing rude, please. Okay, we're not 15 anymore and I can see already there's a, a, a guy coming so he's going to look at me really weirdly. So whatever you're doing, you want to have a little bit of a warm up. Um, this is our, one of our local country parks, so I've biked here but you could go for a walk or you could just, the, the, there's a little bit of a slope. I actually used to bring some of my um, PT clients here because it's such a lovely place and it's easy for parking and it's got a hill that I used to make them run up and down. Mind you, I did as well. But do a little bit of a warm up, so whatever that might be, fit for walk, get out on your bike or something. And then I'm just going to show you a few, um, I'm getting some funny looks from this guy already. I'm going to show you a few exercises you can literally do on a park bench, okay? You can do a full body workout on a park bench. I'm going to show you some squats, I'm going to show you some step ups, um, I'm going to show you some push ups, some triceps, and we're going to do it all on a park bench. You can climb on a park bench, okay? So let's have a little look. Very good, thank you. Can you take a picture? Do a little video. Oh, okay. Do a little exercise video. Sorry? <laughs> Do a little exercise video. Okay, so I'm back again. So that lovely gentleman, I just had to stop the video um, and start again. Well, not start again, but that lovely gentleman actually stopped and had a chat with me for about five minutes about what I was doing and where I was from. So now I'm going to show you those exercises on a park bench. Now, the thing is, don't feel don't feel weird if you're doing this who cares who actually cares it's about you and it's about you know doing things to make your body feel good so if you want to squat in a in a country park squat in a country park who gives a shit about everybody else okay so have a little look and i haven't even got trainers on i've got big boots i've got the insoles in see little man mountain i've got a million layers so literally you're just going to do a normal squat so you're sitting back on your heels if you can aim to touch your butt you know, to the bench, go for it. I'm not gonna do the whole thing, but you could be doing, you know, do 20, 20 squats. Just sit back, keep going. As long as you keep good form, you can do anything. So there's your squats, okay? And then what's quite nice, you can switch from lower body to upper body, it's up to you. You can come to the edge here, or you can go to the edge of the seat. Let's do some triceps. So sticking the feet out. Okay, hands on the, on the heel of your hand, keeping the elbows in, lifting the chest, just drop down up. Look at the nice view. Okay, so again, even if you want to start at 10 or something, just do what you can do. Okay, so there's your triceps. Perfect. Cool. 
to one more. If you want to make it harder, you take your legs that look further, by the way. You keep your butt down near the chair. All right, you can have a little shake out. So we can go back to legs now. Let's go for some step ups. And just make sure you try and get your whole foot on top. Now, obviously, if it's a special bench, they might not want you standing on it. <laughs> If you're in a country car, it tends to be okay. And remember to change leg. You've always got to do the other leg. Okay? Just looking up, up and down, down. Now the other things you can do, like a step up, you can do a step, knee, down, down. And that means you're alternating each time. So you can choose. And you can hear it lifts your heart rate. Okay? It's a great little workout. And you're getting fresh air. Fresh air is so important. Just make sure you're lifting your whole body up. Okay, so we can do some push-ups. If you're quite strong. See, listen. <laughs> if you're quite strong, you can come down onto the chair. Okay, take your full body with you. If that's a bit too tricky at the moment, Come on to the back. Move my bicycle. Come around to the back. Exactly the same. Up on the toes. Keep your shoulders forward. Keep your shoulders forward. Keep your shoulders back. Take the chest down to the back of the chair. Okay? So, you can keep going with those. You've got squats for your butt and the legs. You've got step ups for the quad. You've got tricep dips, obviously the back of the arm. You've got push-ups for chest and front of the arm. How about a plank for the core? So you could be here, or you could be on the elbows. There's your core. Full body, job done. Just make sure your positioning's good. And seriously, it doesn't matter who's watching. You do what you need to do, or you want to do. And look at that, what was that, five exercises? Step up, squat. Yeah, five exercises. Job done. I mean, you could. What else could you do? If you wanted to do back, you could do a little bit of a leg lift. It's a little bit core, a little bit lower back. Um, what else have we got? You could stand up. If you wanted to be, I know you can't see my head at the moment. <laughs> it's probably best that way. You could do a tap down. So you wanted to make it a little bit more cardio -ish. You could do a tap down. You could hold it, it's a, bit, it's a bit slippy here. But if you did have rubber shoes on that wasn't so muddy, you could do some lunges. Okay, but I mean, actually, you could just do some lunges on the spot, can you? Okay, so look, full body workout. It's free, it's free, you get some fresh air. Job done. Okay, please share, like, go out and try. If you want any more information, Either comment below, send me a message on Facebook at Elaine Luck Women's Wellness, or go and have a look at my YouTube channel. Again, I think it's just Elaine Luck Wellness. Or um, send me an email. Oh, I'm happy to respond to that. It's just, um, what is it? <laughs> I've forgotten. It's, um, <laughs> it's hello at elaineluck.com. Okay, get yourself out to the park or the beach or somewhere, find a park bench and just do. Okay, see you next time.